Hello everybody, my name is Gerardo Lara and welcome to my Geography in My Backyard project. Today I'm going to be talking about Opie Schnabel Park. This beautiful park is located off of Bandera and I've had the chance to visit this park a couple times in the past but I've never really taken the time to explore and research it until now. In Opie Schnabel there's a trail that I followed called the Leon Creek Trail. I had followed this path until I had reached this pavilion and past the pavilion um, there was this cliff and I have highlighted here in red the route that I had taken. I had gone past, I'd gone past the pavilion and to the cliff which was blocked off for safety purposes so I safely hiked off trail to get to the bottom of the cliff to get a better and closer look. At the bottom of the cliff, you'll end up in the stream of Leon Creek, which passes through Opishnabel Park. Due to the lack of rain, there isn't much water currently flowing or any water currently flowing in these photos. This is why Leon Creek is classified as a thermal stream, which means it only flows shortly after a raining period, then dries up. Also, since Leon Creek ultimately leads to a larger body of water, it is also known as a tributary stream. This next slide contains photos of the actual cliff, but from below. It took a while to actually hike around and get to this spot, but I was able to capture these photos. The cliff base formed into the way it is as a result of erosion by stream flow. The cliff base also formed into the way as a result of dehydration as well as weathering due to exposure of wind and rain over the years. The video just shown was just a quick glimpse of moss growing on rocks which is an example of chemical weathering thank you for y'all's times and enjoy these photos of deers that i encountered during my visit